Well, it's time to talk women's health with OBGYN Dr. Wendy McDonald. And today we're focusing on urinary tract infection. Yeah, so if you're not comfortable letting your little ones listen to this topic, we'll give you a couple seconds to get them out of the room, okay? All right, Dr. Wendy, thank you so much for joining us here I'm today. I'm so happy to be here. All right, so this time of year, a lot of people are drinking a few more cocktails mm -hmm. than usual because of holiday parties. Can drinking too much alcohol cause UTIs? So in theory, it can, and here's how. You're, you're, <laughs> you're not drinking a lot of water, oftentimes when you're drinking more alcohol. Your immune system can be kind of run down, so you definitely can be more prone to UTIs. Okay. Yes. Okay. And uh, how do we know if our urine is healthy or not? Okay, so this is a good one. We have a little demo here. Okay. You can see what like really clear urine would look like, more like water. And we even have like a touch of apple juice. Little cocktail, just to a little demo just for you to guys. show you, you know, so that we didn't collect it in the bathroom somewhere. That That's this pretty is, clear. It's you know, it's still pretty clear, you know, urine. If your urine looks like this, more, that's not that clear. More tea colored, you know, almost like a touch of brown. Yeah. That's mm -hmm. you're probably not very well hydrated, and you may even have a little bit of blood in that urine, especially if you're feeling kind of uncomfortable. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So be aware of the dark urine. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So um, we got a little demo of how we know whether or not urine is healthy. Yes. But let's talk about cranberry juice because we're used to thinking that that is healthy. That's what your mom always says. Right. Like, so get cranberry juice, antibiotics. Perfect segue to like signs of urinary tract infections. So most of the time people are gonna drink cranberry juice to try to prevent or to treat a, an early urinary tract infection. Mm -hmm. Some of the signs of urinary tract infections can be burning when you urinate. Okay. You can feel like you have to go to the bathroom all the time, like you're frequently going to the bathroom. You have an urgency to go where you're like, get out of the way, I need to go right now. You're pushing your kids out of the way because you really have to go to the bathroom. And then really severe circumstances can even lead to, you know, fevers, chills, back pain, if you maybe even have like a kidney infection. Ooh. So cranberry Cranberry juice is definitely a good thing to use, and we can actually move over to another yeah, demo. Yeah, let's check this out. To try, especially for somebody who finds themselves with frequent urinary tract infections, you're yeah. getting one every month, or you're getting one after certain, you know, mm. physical activities. You might want to drink, you know, maybe a glass of cranberry juice a day, or even take cranberry pills. But is all cranberry juice created equal, Carly? <laughs> Let's talk about that. <laughs> so, I don't think so. I don't think so. So Sorry. there are cranberry juice cocktails that have a lot of sugar in them and maybe not as much actual cranberry. There's like an actual molecule in the cranberry juice that binds to bacteria and makes the, the bacteria not replicate so quickly. This is not gonna have very much cranberry juice in it and it's gonna have a lot of sugar in it. Probably yep. even in this one bottle, twice as much sugar as you need in a whole day. Oof. So urinary tract infections, they're a little bit more common in women just because of how our anatomy is set mm -hmm. up. But what about men? Don't they get them men too? Men can get them too. Men can get them too. It's not as often because of how our anatomy is set up, but okay. they can definitely get them. So hydration with water, having that like pure real cranberry, juice. real cranberry juice. You can look at the bottle and see how much sugar is in it, and it'll tell you oftentimes too, like no sugar added or like real cranberry juice. So that's what you want to look for. Exactly. And, and even says. even cranberry pills. So this is this is D-mannose. Nice. D-mannose is the molecule that's in cranberries oh. that makes the urinary tract infections like not progress. It makes the bacteria actually not, you know, replicate. Wow. So you can actually just take See a cranberry. A big dose of that. There you go. And uh, you yeah. said you still find grown women that don't know this. And for all the little girls out there, front to back. Front to back. Don't go <laughs> reaching down and pulling up. You got the butt's wiping back to front. Okay. Front to back. Push it on down. Front Push it to on back. Down. And for the dads with daughters out there, front to back. Don't you forget. All right, you can follow Dr. Wendy and read some of her latest blog posts on her site, DrEveryWoman.com.